Spader here with another quick video. Um, I've been getting some questions on some of my guides, and um, I want to answer those for you real quickly so I don't get people asking me them all the time. Which I don't mind you guys asking questions, but I try to want to get as I want to try to get as many out of the way as I can. But um, before I do that, I want to give a shout out to Nakakan. Um, he's been helping me get some subscribers and help me. Uh, get going with this video making thing and I really appreciate it and um, if you haven't already subscribed to him or seen his videos um, his name is Nakakan 1993 N-A-K-A-K-A-N -A -K -A -K -A 1993 um, go look at his video, subscribe all that good stuff, he has some really good videos um, but anyway uh, one of the questions I was getting was um, I'm a member but I don't know where to cook and I said in my guide um, cook at the rogues den but I didn't actually go there or show you how to get there so let me show you how to get there real quick um, and you need a games necklace and uh, wow where is it it's over here I'm lost. Okay, there we go. Um, you want a games necklace, and you're going to teleport to the Birthrop games room, and then you're going to go up the stairs in the castle, and yes, my mouse cursor is a harpoon, because I'm fishing, so whatever. Um, you're going to go to Birth Birthrop games room, go up the castle, and then come out, and you're going to go into this bar here. And then you go down, and that is the rogue's den. And there's a bank, and then there's a fire right next to the bank that never goes away. So that's really good to use. That's why I suggest using it if you're a member to get um, cooking to 99. Um, another question I had was um, Tico isn't working well on Internet Explorer. Um, yes, and they were com some people were complaining that they couldn't move this right here back and forth to make it bigger or smaller, and um, that's because Tico doesn't fully support Internet Explorer. It fully supports Firefox. But, um, and with Firefox, you can move that. I'm using Firefox right now. But with Internet Explorer, you can't move that page. You can't move this left and right. It has to stay where it's at. So that's why, um, I didn't say it in the video, but I strongly suggest using Firefox. With Tico, you can use Internet Explorer. It just, you, you won't be able to move that, which I usually keep it where it is anyway. Um, and then I got another question. Um, what's so bad about swordfish? Why don't you want to cook swordfish? And um, you can cook swordfish, um, but swordfish are more expensive, and the amount of XP they give isn't that big of a difference. And um, people don't fish swordfish nearly as much as they fish lobsters, so you're going to have problems buying the amount of swordfish that you want. Uh, as with uh, lobsters, you can get plenty of lobsters because tons of people fish lobsters and um that's it really um but i didn't want to make this guide a total waste for people who wanted or this video a total waste for people who wanted a tip or something so my tip for you today is to uh whoa sorry about that um my tip for you today is to use your ignore list as a notepad yeah, you want to use your ignore list as a notepad. I do it. Um, like for quests, quests that I need to do that I need to remember, I write them down in here. Like Garden of Tranquility and Desert Treasure, and then I write dates and skills down in them so I can remember them. Um, like on March 21st this is when I got 87 fire making. Um, I got 100 combat on June 6th, and then uh, on July 24th I got 99 fire making. So it it's just a good little handy thing. If you don't have anything to write down with real quick, you can just open your ignore list and type something in. Um, so that's about it. Thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and don't forget to go look at Nakakon's videos. They're awesome. Alright, I'll see you guys later.